Hey guys, it's me, Arwen Star Song, and this is a vlog that I've been meaning to do for quite a while, and I finally got time for it right now. So, um, on my channel lately, um, I haven't really been too active. It's mostly because of school. I finished school in less than a month, so. I kind of was like, you know, maybe I should just focus on school for the next few weeks just because I am literally a month away from finishing and I really do want to do well. I want to get my GPA more up than it already is. I want to be able to focus on that and then focus 100% of my time on this channel after that, you know. But um, <clears throat> it's just really hard. I've been meaning to write more music, I have written more music, I just haven't really recorded anything. So what I am going to actually be doing is releasing Dark Cloud next week with the songs that I have demonstrated to you on the little album teaser. And Dark Cloud is no longer going to cost any money, it's going to be free. How that's going to work. On SoundCloud, you just click the download button, I'm going to have the whole album up pretty soon, I'm going to delete all the things that are unnecessary on my SoundCloud and reorganize everything. So that way I can put the songs from Dark Cloud on there, so that way they're a lot more finished up and polished, so that way you guys will enjoy them a lot more. They're going to be free to download, you just press the download button on each song and you are good to go, you're golden. As far as album artwork goes, I haven't really been able to do much of a photo shoot for that either because of school, so I probably will just be not including any album artwork. I will probably just release that later as soon as I can get another shoot. I did do a shoot for Fracture and I do Photoshop my images a lot so that way I can make them into creative things like I did for No More Heroes and The Cross and whatnot. I've been trying to incorporate a lot more creativity in photos that I take and selfies and stuff so that way I don't have to freaking like make time for the photo shoot. It's just that right now I don't have the resources to do so. so I'm trying to like make do with what I have for now since I'm just your average girl doing this for fun. And basically, if you do choose to donate through Bandcamp, you can choose to pay your price. You can choose free when you click the download button, or you can make a small donation to the channel. It doesn't matter what, 50 cents, one penny, every penny counts for something and it's something that's deeply appreciated because the more I can get from you guys, the more I can travel around to film videos and actually put a lot more effects in the videos that are nice. And I really do want to start doing that, so if you choose to donate, that would be very, very helpful and I will thank you so much for that. And if you do, like, donate anything towards this album or choose to pay a buck for it, just let me know and in the next music video, like, you'll get credit. I'm going to be putting people's names in the video that have donated to the channel, so um, just let me know and I will most definitely include you. I will give your channel a shout out. Uh, another thing I've been uh, wanting to acknowledge, cyberbullying. You see, it happens to everybody. Cyberbullying happens to pretty much everybody on the internet. There is a lot of people out there who are just so sick in the head to think that they can go out to these people, big or small, on YouTube and just say the worst crap ever. For example, Casey Ho, I don't know if you know her, she's from Blogilates, and um, I do follow her program. She's awesome, by the way. You better freaking get her program. Blog a lot. It's really, really good if you want to get any exercise. But anyways, continuing. She has been posting lately, a couple of videos actually, on cyberbullying and fat shaming. And people sh like shame her for being fat when really she is freaking hot. She has curves. She is just, she has the perfect body. Like... She's a fitness instructor, so of course she's going to be freaking perfect, but not all fitness instructors are perfect, you know? But the point I'm trying to make here is that it happens to channels big or small. See, there are the big channels like Casey and other bigger YouTubers like Markiplier, PewDiePie. Those two get bullied a lot too from what I hear. I don't know too much about them, but um, there's bigger channels like them 
And then there's other channels that are like medium, you know, they have a big community, about 1 million subscribers to 10,000, you know, like the, you know, minor number of subscribers, kind of a bigger community. And then there's small channels, like me, like several other musicians that I talk to on here, like metal extremists and whatnot. They have a fan base of like about a hundred to growing up to a thousand. Like the ones that are very, very small community and still not really getting too much attention. And it's like, I just don't see why people think that it's worth their time to go to these smaller channels that are trying to make something of themselves, trying their best to exhibit their talent and reach people just to be torn down and bullied like I was. Like, you guys don't even know, I delete all the comments that are mean because they are very hurtful to me. And, well, I get a lot of dislikes on some of my bigger covers of bigger songs because, like, I know my voice doesn't suit the style. My original music was written precisely for my voice because my vocal range is really unique and I can't really cover too much. So, yeah, I scream, I sing, and that's what I do. And I try to make the best of what I have, and I work very, very hard to write my music. Just to have losers just tear me down constantly. There was this one guy that was just like, Oh, don't quit your day job because you're worthless. And not that you're going to even have a day job that's even worth anything, but your existence is just meaningless and you should just quit. And there was this other one that said, in all the 30 years of writing music that I have done, I have never heard anything so shitty in my life. And I'm, I know everybody is entitled to their opinion and I'm not going to bash anybody's opinion, but I can't help but feel like those that leave comments on my channel are jealous of what I have. Because really, I practice every day of my life. I make sure that everything that I write is as good as it can get before I can publish it. And even when I do publish it before it's finished, I say, here's the progress so far. What do you guys think? I'm not trying to bash anybody or anything, but I just feel like those people have issues and smaller channels like me don't deserve that because really all of us are talented every single one of us and bullies do not deserve the right to exist in this world they don't and it gets very very tiring to see these comments because it makes me feel like every single second of hard work that I put into my music is meaningless. All I really care about right now, to tell you the truth, all I care about is the music. I want people to listen to it. And I want people to be empowered and to feel like they can change the world. That's my mission with my music. I write metal because I love it. I've always loved it since I was a kid. And just because I'm a woman, that doesn't mean that I can't scream. I'm sorry, there are plenty of female vocalists out there that can. And I worked very, very hard to learn how to do so without hurting my coloratura or soprano voice. And I think I'm doing pretty decently for what I am. I mean, I don't have time to go out to live performances or anything because of school. Otherwise, I would probably have a band right now. I'd probably be playing in venues. I would probably be writing a lot more music. But right now, I don't. And having 252 subscribers that actually pay attention to my stuff and a pretty decent amount of views, even though I don't really spam too much, I actually kind of feel good about what I've accomplished so far and I really do thank all of you <laughs> for listening and for viewing my stuff and for um, leaving nice things and comments and giving me feedback. It really does help sharing, liking, 
anything that you guys do, it, it really does help me and all 252 of you really do mean the world to me right now. I know it's a small community, but who the hell cares? It's nice. I like it. And no matter how much time it takes, I know for a fact that if I keep going with what I do, and if you guys keep doing what you do on this channel, that this community is going to grow a lot bigger and we can spread the word to change the world. And, well, cyberbullies, I hate to use shitty language here, but cyberbullies, go fuck yourselves. Go burn in hell, because that is clearly where you belong. And there's a special place for people like you, who make people feel bad about themselves. It is never okay to make an individual feel bad about themselves, because that's what leads to depression and suicide and other really, really nasty effects in a person. And that is not okay. Ever. And if I ever see that on my channel ever again, any bully on my channel, any bully that bullies somebody else, you are going to be banned from my channel. And I don't care if you say, well, good, screw you then. Good, I don't freaking need you either. And neither does anyone in this community. Okay, okay? Okay, thanks, bye. I'm really sorry for my rant there. I just get so angry when it comes to cyberbullying subject matter. And, um, I just hate people sometimes, you know? You know, the kind of people that just think that they feel good by bullying others when really, what they say about you says a lot about them. And on that note, I leave all you love leaves to your day. And I hope that all of you stay safe. I thank all of you for your support and for all your help and for watching my videos and for giving me feedback and for helping this small little channel to grow a little and I actually am very happy with what I have. If I get more than cool freaking beans, cool. <laughs> Doesn't really matter. I just do this for fun even though I am a verified partner but I love the music and that is all that matters here. Anyways. On that note, I bid y'all farewell. Toodles!